Speed N and the Speed N Junior were really designed for cold water applications. But if you're not fishing this bait when the water warms up, you're gonna really be missing out because it's a fantastic crankbait anytime you need to be fishing in that you know two to seven foot zone. This crankbait really does a good job in the warm months as well. And I'm gonna show you exactly how to fish this bait and where to maximize its efficiency in the warmer months. There he is, I got him. This is what I mean, that Speed End Junior can never be overlooked in the warm season because when you're fishing what we are today, we're fishing shallow grass flats and I can run the Speed End Junior right over the top of the grass and uh, I'm actually eliciting strikes from these fish just by running it over the top of the grass and I'm not I'm not fishing it crazy aggressive. I'm actually doing a slow retrieve and then as soon as I touch the grass, I stop the retrieve, let the bait back up a little and then continue the retrieve again. And it's that stop and go that's really getting the bites. There he is. What I'm focusing on with this Speed End Junior right now is long flats that come way out into the lake. I mean, we're probably three, 400 yards offshore, maybe 300. And I'm focusing on these flats that come way off of the bank. They have isolated grass patches on it and I'm slowly cranking through the grass patches. But here's, this is the first place in the summertime that the bass are gonna stage before they get way out in deep offshore structure. This is the first section of summer where they're staging and the Speed End Junior is absolutely perfect for this. There we go. All I'm doing is focusing on the ends of these flats. Remember the Speed End Junior and the Speed End were designed for cold water. But if you're not using these baits in the summertime, you're missing out on a really good, fantastic bite. I'm alternating between two colors, tropical shad and holy shad. And really just concentrating where the grass is broken up. I'm keeping my boat in about eight to nine feet of water, casting up to about four to six. It's not difficult. It's a great early summer pattern, Speed End Junior. Man, I love this.